To the class of 2017, today you end one chapter, but you are about to begin the greatest adventure of your life. And I said no, and that's what I promised you I would do, and that's what I did. Yeah, that's right, lock her up. I think there's a lot of fake news out there. Lordy, I hope there are tapes. There were a few of those 7 a.m. meetings that were interrupted by, oh, somebody's tweeted. If the president puts Russian salad dressing on his salad tonight, somehow that's a Russian connection. I think the biggest mis misconception is everything that you're reading. I didn't think I was going to last too long, but I thought I'd last longer than like a carton of milk. I just didn't yeah. last that You know, I can run a little hot on occasions. You're going to brown the uh, onions in some oil, or you can use, you know, if you're a naughty boy, some Crisco. Otherwise, I'll say, Tom, you're fired. I'll get somebody. I was haunted by tweets every single day. Like, what is he going to tweet next? Fitzgerald stepped down this morning after news broke she bought tobacco stocks while pushing an anti-smoking campaign for the CDC. said very strongly yesterday that he's innocent. So you'll have to talk to him about that. He said, will Gary Cohn continue or remain in the administration? I said, I hope so. Now, if he leaves, I'm going to say I'm very happy that he left, OK? You still haven't denied that you called him a moron. And, you know, a lot of people are going to watch this and think he probably said it. Simply put, sir, you cannot stop the men and women of the FBI from doing the right thing. I have a job. It's a, it's a tremendous honor to do this job every day. But I also don't think he would have been subpoena had he graciously um, uh, greeted the FBI agents who uh, first came to visit him. You know, good manners suggest that you say, you know, hi, how do you do? I, I don't know. I don't know. You don't know. You're I don't know the agency. You don't know who did I this? I found out about this yesterday.
Why does it matter when the ethics officials look at the lease and the terms of the lease to determine whether it's ethical Why or not? does it matter? It's because you're renting it from the wife of a lobbyist. 